Hey guys, what's up? In this video, we're going to be talking about automation. So the winners for last video's $1,000 worth of courses or consulting is here. If you guys want to qualify for next video's giveaway, be sure to drop a comment below every single video. I'm picking the best comment to give $1,000 worth of consulting course or courses to completely for free. So drop a comment below and I'll be picking the best one every single video. So let's get into the video. This video is going to be super important because when you pursue e-commerce, you do it in order to travel more, to have that laptop lifestyle. You basically pursue e-commerce to just have more time and freedom. The exact opposite sort of happens where you get into e-commerce, you get into ads, and you're just monitoring your ads every day, and you end up working from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. You're just feeding this wolf, which is your business, that just grows and gets hungrier and hungrier and hungrier. So it's really ironic that the moment you pursue e-commerce and entrepreneurship, you end up working much more than you would have worked in a nine to five, but you're doing something you love. And if you're doing it correctly, you could set up the systems so that this doesn't happen. And that's what we're gonna be going over on this video. Automation. Luckily, Facebook has automated rules, which allows you to basically monitor your ads without monitoring your ads automatically. So let's say for example, you have this winning product. This is a current winner, by the way. I'm dropping current videos daily. Like I don't wanna be popping up some example that's irrelevant and it was a winner in 2017. I wanna drop relevant information. So I actually went ahead, did some product research and this is a winner that's currently hot. So if you guys want it, you can potentially jump on it if you are really, really fast and you have notification bell and you watch this video the moment it came out. You can jump on this because I just saw it on my newsfeed and it's pretty hot and it's getting a bunch of comments. So jump on this product if you want an easy winner. So let's say you have this winning product and you need a cost per purchase around $40 to be profitable. You're gonna to wanna to set up a few rules which I'm gonna to give to you guys today. So rule number one, the no purchase rule. You run this rule every 30 minutes. If ad spends over $100 and you have zero purchases, then pause the ad. Rule number two, unprofitable. You wanna run this rule every 30 minutes. If the ad spend is over $100, but your cost per purchase is over $50, so you're unprofitable by like over $10, then you pause the ad. Rule number three, the comeback rule. You wanna run this rule every 30 minutes, and the rule is if ad set is inactive slash pause, but cost per purchase is under $40, then unpause the ad set. So this is sort of the counter to rule number two. Because what happens is Facebook has a 30 to 60 minute delay on results of sales even after the ad pauses. So when you pause an ad, two, three sales could just come in afterwards. That is sort of delayed. So as a result, you have this rule where if that does happen, you turn the ad set back on now because it had a strong comeback and the ad might be able to run profitably for the rest of the day having this small comeback. So this rule number three allows you to turn ads on that are profitable that have been mistakenly turned off due to Facebook's sort of 30 minute delay. So rule number three is pretty important. Rule number four, hedging weak ad sets. So you wanna run this rule every 30 minutes and if ad spend is over $250, and your cost per purchase is around 40 to 50, so it's sort of near break even, making a small loss, that you wanna reduce your budget by 10%. Rule number five, doubling down on strong ad sets. You wanna run this rule every 30 minutes as well. If your ad spends over $100 and your cost per purchase is under $20, you wanna increase your budget by 50%. So this is super powerful and it allows you to just double down on all your strong ad sets automated on autopilot. So. Yeah, those are the five rules. Like this is super, super important because it allows you to sort of scale, hedge, as well as be hands off on your Facebook ads. So you're able to save more money with rule number four. You're able to make more money with rule number five. Rule number one, two, and three, you're able to basically manage all your ads hands off. So that's Facebook automated rules. I went ahead and gave you guys all the formulas that I personally use and I hope you guys found value in this video. You know, my goal is to hit 50,000 subscribers by the end of 2019. So I'm gonna give you guys just so much value. I'm just gonna over provide in value to make sure that the time you invest in these videos are worth it. So I hope you guys have been enjoying the videos. Drop a comment below with any questions whatsoever. I'll be picking the best comment to give a thousand dollars worth of consulting calls or courses to at the beginning of tomorrow's video. So if you wanna to watch tomorrow's video, be sure to hit the notification bell below to be the first to get that edge by watching my videos earlier. Don't forget to like the video because that helps a lot. If I'm providing you some value, 
drop a like below. If you wanna work with me one-on-one, -on -one, sign up for the mentorship application below. If you want these videos a day in advance, check out the podcast below. That's completely for free. And yeah, hope you guys have an amazing day. Peace.